Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you my first full year of selling on Amazon full time without having any other jobs, which was 2016. So last year, I sold almost $750,000 worth of goods, and this was mostly all through retail arbitrage and online arbitrage. I've only since started getting into the private labeling, which there is a lot of profit in. A lot of people think that this is somehow skewed and that I didn't actually put in these dates and this is over two years or something, so I'll refresh it for you guys. So you can see that this is in fact real. These are my sales. Um, you can, we can go down and we can see. I sell the majority of my items in the toys category. So I did 250k just in toys, 120,000 in computers, cam almost 100,000 in cameras, 85,000 in kitchen, 44,000 in home, and then all the other categories made up for almost 20% of the rest of the sales, and that was another 140,000. Uh, I made another video, which I will link in the description below, of my $26,000 sales day and how I did that, that was, I believe that was either Black Friday or Cyber Monday, I think that was Cyber Monday uh, in 2016, and that was a really, really hot day. As you can see, there was a huge spike for both units ordered and ordered product sales. So I sold 104 units and about $26,000 worth of inventory. And a couple other things to note in this is this was my first full, like I had sold for two years prior to this on Amazon, but I had just done it as a part-time business and basically didn't have the time to put in like I did in 2016 because I did this as a full-time job and earned a full-time income. My profit margins were between 20 and 25%, which is obviously a lot lower than uh, if you source products from China and then private label them using Jungle Scout. But you know what? Honestly, retail arbitrage and online arbitrage is great because there's a few things that I wanted to talk about. Um, first thing is when you order $700,000 worth of inventory, you're getting a lot of money back in credit card uh, rewards. So I have a credit card. It's the MBNA Rewards MasterCard. It's only in Canada, but it gives me 2% cash back. So if you look at this as ordering probably about $600,000 worth of goods after because of profits and whatnot, um, then that's $12,000 just in credit card rewards. And this is only my Amazon. Of course, I have my eBay, which is was another couple hundred thousand. So... I made probably $15,000 just in credit card rewards, which is equivalent to basically working full time at a minimum wage job. But yeah, that's just in credit card rewards. So that's why I like the arbitrage aspect of things. And it's fun to find products that, that sell really well that you can source at a lower price and then sell on Amazon for a higher price. So. If you guys are interested in learning how to do this and how I've found profitable products to sell just from arbitrage, um, it's th over 3,000 sales in 2016 and an average sales per order of $232, then I do offer uh, Skype training and I offer it, it's $100 US per hour, which is going to be going up pretty soon because I'm getting quite a bit of demand, at least for the eBay and Pricematic training. Um, so I'm not going to have enough time to do everyone. So if you do want training on how to grow your business to this point, then I can definitely help you with that. But I would suggest getting in sooner than later because the price will be going up shortly. If you have any questions regarding this, please feel free to comment below. And yeah. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe to my channel.